to talk things through and listen with respect and honor for who we are as members of the body of Christ, each one of us beloved by God. I encourage others to take this transformative journey in their communities too. We can make a difference. Sign Luna. All the words of the play have been written by people of the United Church who have contributed to the Iridesk project. So said another way, um, we who were working on the play, we didn't write one word of this play. This, this emerged from our church, which is amazing. Bringing stories to light that would open up more room for conversation, that was really what we were hoping to achieve. How did Iridesk come to be? Well, at the last General Council, commissioners voted to have a project of dialogue and sharing around the 1988 vote of a membership and ministry of gay and lesbian people. And so from that vote, or from that vote at the last General Council, um, the decision was made to go forward with this project. And then how did it start to take shape? It started taking shape simply by listening to a lot of people um, reading, doing a lot of reading on um, actually the truth and reconciliation um, work that the United Church had, had done, previous projects that the United Church had done around LGBTQ and Two-Spirit um, people in our, in our faith communities, and um, talking and sharing with a lot of people and kind of letting it form together very organically. What for you has been the most surprising? part of all of those conversations, all of those kilometers traveled? Oh, the most surprising thing has to be how generous people are. And I mean generous in a number of different ways. Um, for sure, many people have opened their homes to me to billet, um, which is very generous in that kind of regular way that we think, but also that kind of generosity of spirit, right? Of being open-minded, of being brave to share, um, that generosity in being present to listen to other people, that is just so beautiful to be part of. And I guess maybe not a surprise, but it's just it feels so good to encounter that over and over again. So I love that. The United Church has done amazing work in so many um, areas of social justice and inclusion and welcome. Um, one of our main, well, one song that many congregations sing is Draw the Circle Wide, right? And I think we do a really good job of that, actually. And part of drawing the circle wide is including more people to hear more stories. And so as we continue to draw the circle wide, we're going to need to continue to have these conversa have conversations with people, people we're going to disagree with, people who challenge us, people who um, are just like us, celebrations, laments. So I think that this kind of a, a willingness to engage in, in a project like Iridesk is such a good sign of such a, uh, an open, honest, brave church. Um, to me, it shows how far we've come as, as, a, as a communities of faith and as a larger um, church family. Your gifts to the mission and service of the United Church of Canada help to support programs like this one Thank you, and please, continue to give. <laughs>